Hello everyone, congratulations on going into your intensives for Liberty University's 505 class. I want to reach out to all of you who are going through the intensive and just tell you some of the things that I would have liked to have known before going. So number one, uh, the books, let me grab them. These big honking books, we didn't use them not once during the class so you can save <laughs> you could save some luggage space and leave your books at home number two i was worried about the class being on campus and having to look for parking and making sure we have enough time to leave the house or the hotel so that we can not only find parking but also find the classroom where the intensive is located and it's not like that whatsoever um, in fact it's in a building that's apart from the university which is really really nice it makes parking parking really 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 easy um, you'll print out a parking pass but don't freak out if you don't bring that parking pass with you they have them there for you already uh, one recommendation is do not park at uh, party city because they do tow you so make sure that even if you don't have your parking pass you are still parking at the Liberty University uh, conference center um, something else I wanted to mention was I was also nervous um, about how much homework we were going to have and also how the classroom was going to be set up I had it in my mind that it was going to be a classroom in which we all sit in and it was going to be a hundred percent lecture and um, I also imagined that we would be uh, going home every evening with a ton of homework and memorizing things and taking quizzes and uh, writing a bunch of papers but it is not like that at all Woo, thank God right <laughs> so you typically I believe I just finished and I feel like it's already the, the pieces are slipping away so I wanted to make the video today for that reason so class started I believe at 8 o'clock every morning except the first day they allow more time for you to get there so you'll show up at 8 30 but it's 8 o'clock every morning from 8 to noon it was purely lecture but this is good solid juicy lecture time really juicy um, lectures that you'll hear I mean everything that the professor is saying is so valuable and really good information to have what's great is that you don't have to kill yourself writing um, all of these notes you don't have to work your hand writing all these notes because the professor will also print out um, not print out she'll have it available on blackboard for you so you can print them out uh, later on so you don't have to worry about that you just sit in the classroom and you just absorb everything that the professor is saying and throughout the lecture she'll break it up like it was never from 8 to 12 just sitting the whole time um, she'll break it up with practices um, and also uh, you'll have breaks in between as well and what I mean by practice is usually you'll find someone that's sitting next to you and you'll practice a counseling technique just you and that person one-on-one -on -one. and it's really good to hear feedback from your peers on how that counseling uh, technique worked for you or how it was being the client because you'll have the opportunity to be a counselor but you'll also have the opportunity of being a client throughout the classroom as well anyways after lunch well lunch is typically at noon and they will have a shuttle there for transportation that will take you to Liberty University it's cafeteria I believe um, so that makes it really easy too you don't have to worry uh, so much about transportation in fact there's a lot of hotels that are near the conference area so if you were to stay at one of those hotels you actually don't need a vehicle really because the transportation takes you to go get food and you could just walk to and from the hotel so it, it actually makes it really nice and really easy we stayed in an Airbnb because I brought my son who is a year and a half old with us and also my in-laws uh, because they were staying with the baby while my husband and I were taking the class so 
that was a little different so we stayed at an Airbnb that was really really nice if you guys want the information to that Air Airbnb I'll link it down below so you'll have about an hour for lunch and then you'll come back and instead of sitting in that big classroom uh, listening to more lectures what they'll do is they will divide the class up into different sections so there's going to be other professors that will come in and you'll be uh, divided into smaller groups to go into separate classrooms within that classroom you're going to be doing most of your practice time and from there they'll divide you into smaller groups where um, where you can practice more of the counseling techniques that you learn during lecture as well so it's really fun you don't have to freak out <laughs> um, this information was I don't even have the words to say for it it was so valuable to me I learned so much like this has changed the whole game for me and for my husband as well he was saying this was worth it and we are so excited to go into our next intensive I just want to encourage every single one of you that's watching right now that is anxious nervous about this intensive that's coming up you may be feeling overwhelmed right now but I promise you the information that you'll be receiving from this class is so so important and so precious and I know that every single one of you watching this can do an amazing job and you will do a great job and you will pass the class and you will be able to make it work with your schedule and with your time so I just want to encourage you all that if you're watching this and you're about to go into your intensive or maybe you're watching it and you're not sure if you want to take the intensive, I just encourage you all to pray for God's perfect timing when that is and when you do go into it, I know you can do it. I have faith in you. For any of you that have gone through the intensive class before and want to add a piece of information that you think would be valuable to uh, your peers that are going into this, uh, please leave it down in the comments below. I would love to read what you guys are saying. I would love to read any questions that you have. Um, so please, let's help each other out and add uh, valuable information in the comments. If you want to get a hold of me, Instagram is the main area that I check every single day. That's my main, main account. So if you have any questions and you want me to answer them right away, hit me up on my Instagram. All right, you guys, so I just want to leave that here, and I look forward to, to seeing what God has planned for each and every single one of you. So I hope you all have an enjoyable day, weekend, and I'm excited for you. I know you can do it.